here we go. All right, and uh, and here we are. My my name is uh, my Lord Chaos here. Hi everybody, how are you doing? And today we are diving into 13 cent notes Ag Ag Agnes Rim, Igneous Rim. I mean Agnes Rim. Well, either way, we're gonna try to dive in with a new game. So let's see uh, how the story unfolds. Please select a new audio language. Audio language can be changed in the optional menus. So we're gonna go with uh, the English option right here. Let's see how the our overall um, presentation is gonna be in this one. I repeat. We interrupt this program to bring you an important emergency broadcast. A large unidentified object has crash landed in the city. It is headed north toward Kisumijo, destroying everything in its path. A state of emergency has been declared in Ashitaba City. The neighboring three wards are advised to evacuate immediately. Oh man, it seems like a big deal. Further instructions. Be advised that the express lanes are currently out of service. Roads are expected to face heavy congestion. Proceed with caution. That, that must be some henshin. Uh, you know, transformation. Oh, I'm sorry, there we go. It's a summoning mech. Like Titanfall, I guess? It just teleports in there. go and so that's, that's a pretty good view man right there it's really happening oh Just yeah as you said a kaiju attacked like in that movie so we'll do what we have to do get in the robots and fight our fate was sealed a long time ago Okay, all right. We got a mech battle over here. More of a strategy, uh, RTS. Am I inside the robot? What the? Where did my clothes go? Warning, Dino signature is approaching. Enemy in range. Was that my voice? It's like hearing myself talking in my head. Preparing to intercept. Initiating tactical analysis. All right. So it's, it's coming this way. Oh, how do I move this thing? For you, Sarkakoon, can you hear me? Gojo Senpai, what are you? Why are you in Sekigahara's Sentinel? Senpai, so it's not her, like her mech. You know, you just pull a lever. You know, no that's how it works. Uh, we'll push the button. For the fundamentals. Sentinels are made to be controlled with your mind. Okay. Think of it as another body connected to your brain. An extension. Try to direct it. You can do it. Like this? Mm -hmm. Whoa, it moved! But now my head feels weird. It's like scratchy or something. That's the link system of the nanomachines inside your brain. You'll also have a direct feed of information from the Sentinel's sensors. It should sound like your own voice is speaking directly to you. For now, you'll just have to get used to it as you fight. Can you move? Y yes, I can walk, Senpai. They're coming closer. I keep okay. getting these pop-ups in the way when I try to look around. That's your equipment interface. That to neutralize the D forces in front of you. I don't know if I'm doing this right, but how's this? 
To control your pilots, move the cursor over a pilot and move with X. Once the menu is open, press X to select action and destroy the enemy using arm mounted machine cannons. Alright. Oh, okay, so I just. Uh, repair. Action. Okay, so far so good. Oh, I see him, a whole squadron. Select action and destroy the enemy using multi rocket launchers. Alright. Adjust the attack range with the uh, L stick to target as many enemies as possible. Stay calm. Alright, so we go with um, that area. Perfect shot right there. Right behind her. That's pretty much the guy There's that was just no watching the uh, mech at the very beginning. I remember doing this in my dreams. I think I can do this. Wait until we call for backup, Izumi. My name is Juro Kurabe. Select action, then select heavy knuckles with L to attack enemies in front of you while moving around. Alright. Are done? What are you saying? His name's Zero. Get it right. Bay. May 1985. All right. This is a little flashback. This message again. just faded. What is going on? Come on, Juro. Let's go home. Shibakun. Basic controls. Move. Press X. What's up with you? I just get this weird feeling sometimes. Like something's you know, off. Dream dreaming about neck balance. Going to school, living my there life. There you go. Okay, okay. It's like I'm not supposed to be here. You've seen too That's many what everybody movies, says. Thought, thought cloud. Sometimes when you learn about a specific person or thing, it can be added as a keyword. Press Shango to open the thought cloud to select a con and contemplate keywords. Alright. Shiba. Shiba Kun's a bit of a class clown. But he's a good friend. I always talk to him about action flicks. <laughs> okay. Speaking of movies, I brought your video back. Thanks for letting me borrow it. Already? I just lent it to you yesterday. You wasted no time. Can you blame me? 
giant robots fights in the city? I was on the edge of my seat. <laughs> you sure love Mecha, don't you, Jero? Yup. Weird tape has been added to the thought cloud. Alright. When this option is available, a triangle will appear above their head. Here you go. Well, let me know if you have any others to recommend. Sure, yeah. Yeah, it's like really a VHS buff, to say. Huh? <laughs> Do you think it's too much? Well, now that you mention it, I've been seeing this stuff in my dreams, too. Yep, definite movie addiction. You're showing all the signs. Soon enough, you won't know the difference between fiction and reality. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think I've seen a movie about that. Wait, I'm trying to remember what movies are like where they can't de defer from uh, reality and fiction. Fuyusaka-san's asleep again. School's out for the day. Should I wake her up? Come to think of it, in that movie yesterday, the girl piloting the robot looked awfully familiar. Okay, so I'm not gonna wake her up. Just give her a nudge. Hey, by the way, I saw that one video up for rent. Oh, the one you told me about the other day? Really? Yep, gonna rent it. I've got to. Oh crap. Give me a minute, I'll be right back. Hit <laughs> that run. It's always something. Guess I'll wait here. Wonder what he's up to. Shall we go home with Sammy chan Ah, uh, sorry. I've got plans with someone. Let me guess. It's Nenji kun right? Ew. It's no. a boy, her. I mean, she it lies. is a guy, but. Yuri chan met someone special, too. I'm the only one left. You're all so lucky with boys. It's not fair. Man, that was, that was a reaction. Did you need something? Oh man, it called uh, me out right there. Not really. So as I was saying, it's like she's gonna remember that. That movie's a hidden gem. It's tough to get a hold of these days. Mm. That movie's a hidden gem. Right? It's tough to get a hold of these. Ew, no. I mean, it is. Yuri Chan likes to find me. That movie's a hidden gem. Okay, so I just head over here. She always seems to be sleeping, and then she shows up in my dreams. I can't help but be a little curious about her. Okay, next one. She becomes a bit of a class clown, but oh, we already got we already got into that. Hold on a sec, Miyoko. Did you need? Oh, we already have this interaction. Okay. So we just, I guess, keep moving over here. Wonder if there's a run button. Oh, there is. Okay. Just head out over here. Nothing else I could. Hey, Fuyusaka-san, rise and shine. Okay. Class is already over. Kurabe kun? Um, thanks. You were out cold, huh? Just now, I. I had another weird dream. And you were there. Huh? Me? Had some dream. What kind of dream was it? Well, um, dude, this uh, sucks, man. Can't find Amiguchi anywhere. Wait a minute, what's going on here? You two are looking awfully cozy. <laughs> it's not like that. Mm -hmm. Hmm? Oh yeah. Then what's the problem? <laughs> Don't mind me. Carry on. <sighs> Sorry for you, Sakasan. Let's talk about this some other time. Yeah. I'm going home now. Oh. Okay. See you tomorrow. Man, she's really not liking 
Uh, okay. What? I know I shouldn't tease you, but it's your fault for keeping secrets for me. Hey, I'm sorry. I'll buy you a crepe next time. Jeez. But seriously, Amiguchi. We gotta catch that guy. You wanna hang out again? He's got all the good video games. Just Crap, I shouldn't have actually uh, skipped that. But the sucky thing is, he's never around unless you make plans. Everyone's training hard with their teams. You know, Amiguchi Kun usually grabs a snack on his way out. Maybe I should join a club too. Maybe he's still around. Oh, in the cafeteria? That's right! He was there during break too. Right, I see. Oh. Yeah. What is it, Sawatari san? Okay. Those papers on the podium. Could you take them to Miss Morimura in the nurse's office? Me? Well, it's your turn this week. Oh, is it? Alright, I guess I gotta pick these facts of papers. Is this it? Y yes, that's right. Please take care of it. Alright, so that's... Okay, we just gotta head over there. Oh, I can't end track with them now. Let's head to the cafeteria, grab your stuff, and come on. Um, about that. Let's head to the cafe, grab your stuff. Um, about. I right, just head out uh, right before. He's on the right side. We can leave. Let's head to the grab your stuff. Um, about that. All right. Amiguchi Kun's not the most smart, athletic, and popular with the ladies. On top of that, his family is rich. He's got all the latest video game consoles in his room. All right. Sorry, I can't. These papers. I need to take them to Miss Morimura. <sighs> Seriously? I'll do what you gotta do, but we're not giving up on Amiguchi, all right? I'm gonna head over to the cafeteria. Grab your bag and meet me there when you can. I mean, they make it sound like it's the most hardest uh, errand to do. Oh, skip that. I accidentally skipped it. Fine. All right, let's see how it goes. Excuse me. Hmm. She's not here. What should I do with these papers? Can I just leave them here? I mean, they're pretty much papers. Hmm? There's a document with my picture on it. What is this? Oh, check it out. I'll just take a peek. Juro Izumi? It's my photo, but... But that's not my name! The last name is wrong. I'm Juro Kurabe. <sighs> Alright. Symptoms. Psyche stabilized via drug administration. Patient is obedient. General good health. Drugs, huh? <laughs> Busted. Oh, Karabe kun What brings you here? Just gotta drop off some papers, Miss Um Maramora. Anything I Oh, there you go. I think you forgot these. Oh my. You brought them back for me? I was told it was my turn this week. You got, I gotta say it with a very nervous throat etched voice. You know what, actually, the, way, the voice I have right now would be perfect for this. I brought your papers, Miss Moromora. I see. You're a good kid, Karabe-kun. Thank you. I appreciate the help. Shiba-kun's waiting for me. I should go oh. to the cafeteria. Hey, anything else? Oh, one more thing. God damn it. Karabe-kun, how is your current condition? 
my condition. You know. Any heart palpitations? Dizziness? <laughs> headaches? That reaction. Are you getting enough sleep at night? Why do you ask? There's a nasty cult going around. At this time of year? That's a bit odd, isn't it? I'll give you some medicine just in case. No, thank you. I'm fine. Really. I see. If you'll excuse me. Okay, that should do it. Well, ah, god damn it. Still here? Oh, now we're just about to see you. What's up? Amiguchi wasn't in the cafeteria. Figured I'd try here. Well, guess that's all we can do. Let's drop by the video store on the way home. Come on. Same day heading home heading home. Shopping district. Okay. Something wrong? You couldn't catch Amiguchi. The video store was a waste of time. This sucks, man. Amiguchi kun's not the most he's smart. Okay, uh, we he's got all covered the this area. It's true that one video was already rented out. But we didn't come back empty-handed. What? That old ass kaiju flick? Daimos versus Mecha Daimos. Okay, I wonder who what they're referencing with it's that. It's a real masterpiece from 74. You and your giant robot. Hey, I got a flyer from the theater the other day. It showed what movies they're playing this month. I'm getting way too excited by skipping some of the dialogue options. I, I really shouldn't do that. Sorry about that, folks. Guess what was on there? The original Dimos. Do you want to go? Jeez, a hundred times wasn't enough for you? A sci-fi movie from 1954. Heavy on the special effects. The first in what will become a long-running series. So it's not like a Godzilla film? A sci-fi movie from 1954. Heavy on the special effects. The first in what will become a... All right, so I guess we keep moving. The Sentinel isn't responding. Miracun? The activation. I know I did it right. Why won't it start? Oh, damn. You know this guy? Yeah, it turns out I don't. Miracun? Uh, sure, Okun. What's wrong? Is everything all right? You look awful. Do you feel sick? I'm fine. Your forehead. Did it just light up? He's Sorry, like, you're not supposed to see that. You shouldn't touch it. It's it's <gasps> space herpes. <laughs> what the? My hand's lighting up too. No. I want to see a doctor, kid. What's going on? This is bad. <laughs> Sentinel number 13. Transmitting. Don't tell me. Are you? That doesn't explain if even if um hypothe hypothetically he's synced up to the mech, how is the kid supposed how's that supposed to work out? I mean he wouldn't know how a future thing like that's supposed to work. He summoned a sentinel. Wait. It looks different. That's a robot from that movie. You idiot, what are you doing? Send that thing back. I did that? Okino's damn code. He added a forced activation protocol. Well, this will be interesting. Are you... You leave me no choice. I'm gonna need you to forget about this for Shiba Kun. What the hell's going on here? You and the friend was in on it? Oh man. That's actually a pretty good uh, protocol. I mean, well, part to end the video at for part one. Well, technically, this is a prologue. Uh, I appreciate those that tuned in. Uh, if you can, Hit that like button, hit the subscribe, 
And uh, if you feel uh, a little generous, hit that Ko-Fi account, which I have listed in the video description, and leave a small donation as it does help the channel out. I appreciate those that are tuning in for the video. This is My Lord Chaos uh, signing out. Thank you so much.